Starting from the number one, we have faster startup. It's of no surprise that Linux boots much faster than Windows, as it's a much lightweight operating system and does not have a whole burden of things going in the background. Just compare it to Windows, and you get the thing. At number two, we have less background resource usage. It's of no surprise that Linux does not suddenly use your CPU or your network in the background and slow down your things. At number three, we have hot corners and better view of the task going in the PC. With the help of hot corners, we can easily open the task view equivalent in Linux, which easily allows us to switch between workspaces or known as desktops in Windows 10, and also. Gives you option to view all of your windows at once, or the windows open on one desktop, or say one workspace. It makes things pretty handy, and its usage is better than Windows 10. Number four, better driver support. It was kind of surprising to me that Linux already had support for the drivers of the devices that I had. I mean, the audio was working, even the Intel HD graphics were working properly. There was no as such problem with the monitor, mouse, and the keyboard as well. Number five, a better menu. Unlike the start menu in Windows 10, the menu in Linux Mint is much better, as it nicely groups our applications into categories. And if we hover our mouse pointer over the applications, it gives a description, which is pretty great. Number six, complete customization, absolutely free. Unlike Windows 10. We do not have to pay 10,000 rupees or even 15,000 rupees just to enable the personalization. Here, for free, we can personalize our operating system, and I'm not just talking about changing the wallpaper and the accent color. Here, we can personalize many more things, which is much, much better and much ahead of Windows 10, like changing the animations, changing the icon pack, changing the looks. And I mean, there is a lot to customize inside this operating system. Number seven, the file transfers on Linux are much faster than Windows 10. Number eight, support for Windows programs without any emulation. Yes, it's not a joke. We can run Windows programs in Linux without any emulation or a virtual machine. And many programs work this way. It's done with a software known as Wine, and it's great. Number nine. We have complete ownership of our operating system and we can do whatever we want inside of it. Also, there is no one spying on us and the OS does not send our data online. I mean the usage data which is sent in Windows 10. There is nothing like that over here. Number 10. Far better updates than Windows 10. First of all, here nobody forces us to do updates and the second best is that we do not need to reboot our PC to install updates. Yes, updates are installed in the background. Number 11. Windows-like programs. First, I thought while shifting to Linux that it might be complicated, but many of the programs which I used to use on Windows are exactly the same on Linux, except some minor design changes, but who cares about that? I'm talking about OBS Studio, VLC Media Player, and a few more. And that's another plus point for Linux. Number 12. Better window snapping than Windows. In Linux Mint, we can snap windows to four corners or to the left half or the right half. But the better thing is here that we can also snap them to the top half and the bottom half of the screen. Number 13. Desk Splits Yes, this feature is similar to the gadgets in Windows 7, but hey, they don't exist in Windows 10, so it's better to have them here in Linux Mint. Number 14. A much better software manager. Unlike the Microsoft Store of Windows 10, which just brings mobile applications to desktops here the software manager in linux is better i mean it brings proper desktop programs which is 
वेरी गुड नंबर फिफ्टी बेटर परफॉर्मेंस दैन विंडोज टेन इट्स ऑफ नो सरप्राइज दैट देर आर लेस बैकग्राउंड प्रोसेस गोइंग इन लिनक्स दस द resources of our system will be invested more into the program rather than the background processes and this bench just proves that thing now even though we have reached the end of this video it's not the end of the better features in linux than windows 10 stay tuned for future videos about linux on my youtube channel okay then that's it for this video thanks for watching and goodbye